This here used to be the Spurn Heritage Centre. Ah, it was a big thing, this tends to bank council up on it. Uh, it was turned over then to Mountain Rescue. But uh, when this place first opened, you used to be able to pan for gold. There was no gold mine on the Spurns then. The wee stream over there you could pan for gold. And that's the first you ever heard of panning for gold in the Spurns. And uh, pan for gold now. Like, was, you're all wee computers and stuff back then, computers were high tech like. But there's nothing, nothing to say what's here now, like. That must be a reed bed sewage thing over there. So they were ahead of the time there. I them. There's so many touristy things that never worked out for Stabana Council. This one didn't work out. I said, middle of nowhere, like, middle of nowhere. Um, there's a mill outside Donna Manor that failed. Uh, there's the visitor centre in Castle Derg that failed. The councils aren't any good at doing stuff like this. You just can't do it. Port Rush and all the... Like a Dundas centre failed. I don't know see just what's left now. So there's the original path and I was put in for it. Not the wee street light. Ah oh, look at the climbing frame up there. Luna! So they're building the thing here now. They've a play parked in if it's Luna or Wayne's. Let me see. They must be building a new thing up here now. Whether this is the community group or whether the, the council is going to try and spend more money to get tourists to come. So you see how they're putting the pavement down? Using this plastic stuff here. It's fiberglass. That's fiberglass there and plastic together. Oh, it's a type of, maybe not fiberglass, that wouldn't be allowed now. There's something similar. Oh, that's here now though. Look at that. But I'm walking around here with this thing. Now the wee play park down there is the Nelly play group. That's a sign that's on it. But you wouldn't give us the wee local crowd this here, would you? Oh, you know what it is? Sculpture trail. I've seen a sign, sculpture trail. So the whole idea of the putting these, that's like the, um, the Tannies and Stavan. So it's supposed to be. They want tourists to come and see this sculpture. Ah, you might get a wee cafe opening up in there then, you don't know, you don't know. But, uh, people don't want to come a whole way out here to see the Spur and Heritage Centre. But they're going to come out and see a sculpture, or be a, it's a nice sculpture. Ah, it's a very good sculpture. Some of you bugger set on fire, like. As far as sculpture goes, that's nice there. Eh? That is nice. I'm impressed myself, I am now. That's really well done now. I just hope somebody doesn't set fire to it. It'd be very easy to put a tire on it, wouldn't it? Right here, like. A lot of screws on it. Some of the close up work now, wouldn't you know? Unless they're going to cover it up, like you see the pencil lines and all. How many angles are right? 100% like? So far back, look. See, I like a wee bit of woodwork. The screws are out in these here, you don't pay much. It's stainless steel screws, so that's a good thing. Hang on, these screws are a bit dear there. Some pile of wood in that, isn't it? It looks like all off cuts and stuff too. And they haven't just gone out and bought brand new wood. There's bits of off cuts and all used in it. Like, that's stuff you put around a window, hasn't it? It's all recycling, isn't it? You know what I'd love, but wouldn't it be brilliant if there was a wee door to get inside? Put them ones with them, taking drugs and everything, wouldn't it?
So I like looking to see how the is put together now. Like, but all the wee screws there showing up there. They're not quite tight enough. I like I like working with wooden stuff. You see random. I can't do random. I like to have things even. I thought say no, random's good, but I can't do random. See why like something you just put up on the other side of the board. I want to get one they fit right like. I like to have my wee screws more even. It's all this random stuff. You have to be an artist to do random. See that wee board there, crack there. But see, you're going to get wee wings one to climb on that. Might be such a good idea of climbing on it. Do you see where the face and all is done perfect? Every board matches the face. That's more the way I sort of do things. Why well, these boards don't meet up so well. Different thicknesses and stuff. They're nailed onto the same piece of wood. Screwed on the same piece of wood, but that wood is thicker than that piece. That's the way it worked out, probably. But more of these are going to crack and all as 10 goes on. There's one there crack. And then water's going to get in. So I don't know how long it's going to last. But see, for now, that's a good thing. Because it means you get called out to do another one. Where's my Luna gone? Luna! Well, there you are. See, I'm accusing you in the wrong. If you want to know what kind of varnish to use for it. Because people might want to make one of these themselves in their own house. Let's see that. Sega wood varnish. That's an oil, use an oil. Ah, see, oil is always better than varnishes. There's a brand name there. Guided by nature. What do you reckon the art form, Luna? That's a preview there. That probably won't be now. That won't probably won't be in the news now until um, six months time. A bit late for this summer. It might launch it for next summer. Maybe it was supposed to be finished for the summer, but probably COVID and all the rest held it back. The faces are very good, aren't they? See, he's, he's got teeth messing up at the top. There's a lot of work in that, in that there. Like stuff feels, stuff feels a wee bit tacky from the varnish. How they have the plans for that, I don't know. That's very complicated. Look at the ear. That's a 3D ear, like. You can pick a wee bit of wax out of there. Use the nail gun. No screws here. And the, the nails must have stuck in a wee bit and I found them down. Problem with finding them down now, you've exposed the metal and it's going to rust. That's stainless steel nails. Do you get stainless steel nails? I don't know. And the fingers and all. That's more mucky there. You think I've once climbed on already? No, no, she likes this. She likes the landscaping. Oh, she loves the landscaping. Something here for everybody. These wee rocks there, you can sit on them. You can sit down and you can admire the art. Hey, you know what, bud? Do you know what? That, like, that has a nice wee chair there. That, that is comfortable to sit on there. If you had a couple of wings doing, doing your head on, like, you can just let them climb there and sit down and listen to the birds. Ah, do you know some wee winner want to get to the end finger and then I've fallen off? But the mountain rescue's still on there. They're about with the stretches. How are you going to stop Wayne's climbing on it now? It's not meant to be climbed on. It's 
So in Victorian times, the, 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 they put a wee bit of, a wee bit of circle fence there, or cast iron, and it done the part. It would look okay. They can still do that. Put, just put a wee fence around it. Don't let people climb, just let them look at it. That was worth stopping off there now, didn't it? We spent longer than that then, we did the standing stones. What do you reckon, pet? Are you not spending much time with the sculpture? There's nothing to say now what that old bum used for. It was mountain rescue. How much mountain rescue they do in out here, I don't know. But there's your path there now. Anyway, might want to put a gravel path in your garden. This must be a new way of doing it. So you put down your base there, gravel first, and you put down this stuff here. That holds your gravel together. I imagine that that and this stops the weeds coming up. So I'll come back here in five years' time and see what it looks like. It's all in me off cuts there. I say there's a lot of wee boys and um what do you call them wee places there uh, allotments. See the boys in allotments, they'd love them there. Uh, I'd get down between the cabbages and stuff. And we off cut. They don't tie up very well right here, do they? We'll buy a line up above and speed line there. Ah, they killed the wee tree. I remember going to that building there. I was in it once, on the computers. Computers was a big thing then, like, they are just coming out. And you had your wee thing, you push your wee keys to get things to happen and all, like. And that was the biggest, our mad planet turn was the same. Computers. Blackpool uh, Tower. The computer could talk, and you could type out a swear word, but it wouldn't do the swear words. Everybody would try. Luna! Come up here. Whenever this opens here now, you're going to have more people stopping in this car park. And they're going to be walking around here like I am. So that's just a fire exit, that's all that is. You know, why should they brush the path? See, that day was all cleaned up, that's as good as the day they put it, put it in. The fence, I oh know, I was going to say the fence lasts it pretty well. It's just a bit something there. If you wanted to open this building today, the public, I probably wouldn't pay, but then you put in new fire alarm systems and sprinklers and all the things to meet the new regulations. It's probably cheaper knocking it down and rebuilding, rewind it and everything else. The gutters are only made of metal and they've lasted well, haven't they? If that was an old plastic thing, it would have fell down before now. Imagine before they open this up, I have to tell this place, I have to fence it off or something. It's that boy's coming over like me. See, I think we should try and preserve that wee street light in front. It hadn't even been vandalised or nothing like. There wasn't a wee light. But I would do the new path, pet. I don't want to go too close to the bottom because we're in for trespassing or vandalising or something like that. But they're joining this path onto this path. They're, bringing, they're going to bring it across. So maybe they have plans for that building. But 
people stall. There's not many people come that main road. Listen, you can't hear no traffic. See they're on there. They have a concrete base there for a picnic table or something. But they're still covered in stones to make it look like the rest. That's on concrete. There's a wee plastic litter bin on there. That can't be as old as the building. But it's been tossed in there. Tell you what, this wee path's okay to walk on. There's a wee stream in there. No, you can't get the wee stream. You know, down there where you wee pan and pan for gold. Gold, see what? No, no, you want to do some panning for gold. Mom will go down and do a bit of panning for gold here. But it's funny how originally they brought you here to pan for gold, and now they're totally ignoring the stream. I'm not going to claim the new fence. No, there's no time building it. I'll we'll walk around it. Mom would only see there's any gold. Now you'd hire your wee pan in there, and you come out, to, you actually come out to the stream, and you would actually pan for gold. I think there definitely is gold in them hills, because they are mining gold here now. And all the locals are all against it. So it's been a while since anybody's been panning here. Oh, a wee bit of fresh stuff might, might come down. And I don't know how long it takes and how much you get. But you wouldn't allow one out down here to help in safety now to pan, would you? See any gold in there, Luna? Any gold? You see that gravel there? That's you want to check for the gold. We, you put it in your wee pan, you get the old loose gravel on the bottom. You give it a wee shake and all. Ah, you see the old movies, the old western movies years ago. But unlike the western, there's no big gold town that's sprung up around here. So back in the day, you might you could have walked on up there, up in all nicely cut and I don't know how everybody fighting over the one we spot like. But as you can see it never caught on. Nobody made no money out of it, so the boom never happened. Place closed down. Close down there, I can just see it through the hill. Luna! Oh, Where Where's Luna gone? Luna Mon! Luna! I think she's part. I can hear rocks moving like. No, she's coming up now through the bushes. Ah, Luna! I was trying to get through the bushes. She gets herself in some places, I tell you. I don't think I put the wee. I washed out a colour in her. Look at the wee butterflies. White with orange wings on them. They're very small. Wee orange tips. Very small. Size a wee moth, but they are butterflies. They blend in well with the where the I turned the wrong way around. He's pointing me now. If he showed me his wings, like he's, he's back to front. It's like a wee white moth with orange. The orange is so bright. One of the orange wings, you wouldn't see him. Well, I've got a skeleton wee butterfly. To, a bumblebee? You know what? The bumblebee's not as big as it. There's wildlife up here. Oh no, Luna! They probably stole some of them uh, stones off past his tombs, you know. Ah, you don't know. So is that big plant? That must be for another wee seat. Does he always sit down there in a wee double seat? They're covered in gravel unless you agree there, you see. I've seen five years ten of a big trees growing there. That don't always happen. This Glen Alley Road's quite long, all the way from Plum Bridge out to here. Must be five miles, I don't know. 
I didn't drive from Plumbridge to here, I, I joined on to it. But the play group has a couple of wee things there. I think it's just handy just going to Plumbridge. So unless the U just places a community hall now. So the name's on this here now, Sculpture Trail. So I, I think if they're building this sculpture here, they must be building sculptures elsewhere. El elsewhere. It's a trail, isn't it? More than one. So there's some of these popping up around. I imagine the whole of Ireland, you know. Not going to make us walk down, do I? You have to laugh sometimes the way they put up these fences now, don't you? Like, Ah, they have to do is help and safety, like even though they know they don't work. The Sparrow Sculpture Trails, so there's only the Sparrows. Supporting rural tourism, investing in the local community, celebrating history, culture, and our built and natural heritage. Dava Forest. Benelli Valley, Muller, Current, never heard tell that all one. Funded under the Rural Tourism, Northern Ireland Development. But see, shouldn't take a sculpture to get you out here. I'm out here now, I've seen the sculpture. How am I going to help local economy now? If they want people to come out here, all they need to have is a free motorhome parking. People will come if you get up here in a motorhome. I see if you give them a wee lefty hookup, oh, you wouldn't get rid of them. All them boys going to put Russian stuff, they'd all come up here. Uh, apple, apple, I don't know how you print that. Apple, like, apple something, whatever it is. True. I guess they're off to America, that. Uh, 20,000 years ago, the Spurn region and most of Ireland, not all of Ireland, a wee bit of it was still sunny, most of Ireland was covered in a vast ice sheet. Today's Spurn landscape has largely been formed by thus the last glaciation, evidence of which can be found all over the Spurns. Uh, with the end of the glaciation some 12,000 to 15,000 years ago, vegetation and wildlife gradually colonised the Irish landscape. It is thought, however, that the first humans didn't arrive in the Spurns until some 7,000 to 8,000 years ago. With the oldest surviving evidence of people in the Spurns dating from the Neolithic and early Bronze Age, 3,000 to 6,000 years ago. Several examples of uh, historic structures such as portal tombs, wage tombs and small ritual sites. Uh, we've we'll found the portal tombs, the wage tombs, I haven't seen ritual sites. And Linelli, during the Iron Age, the Spurns supported a relatively large population. That's because everybody was eating spuds and breeding like rabbits. This is evidenced by the large number of wrath remains formed here, and that's before the potatoes. During this period, the era of the Celts, metalworking developed on a new level of sophistication. Ah, the first thing they made is a weapon. Still using them to this day. The most precious of all metals, gold, is known to have been extracted from the stream and rivers of the Spurns. It took them a long time, wouldn't it? Both like, the way you build a portal to him, you might need to split your team up. Like, these boys, you go over there, spend 20 years at the portal to him. And Paddy can go over there and spend five years getting a bit of gold. It's supposed to be, getting the gold was the handy one, wasn't it? Like, maybe five years down that wee stream, but... Uh, in the latter half of the 19th to early 20th century, the Nelly farmers bred large flocks of geese for the Christmas markets and to the barn there. The geese were walked of the flock to the markets. They walked them, see that's what I mean, they walked geese in them roads. And now they want you to put a dog in a lead. You know, they used to walk the geese one time. It took two or three days to complete the journey. I said the geese were a lot slimmer by the time they got there. Uh, 
It's all excitement here, isn't it? It's all excitement to be had. Ah, oh, this capital girl, Linda's not a fond of these capital girls. We wallow and all could never have done them. Look at that there, she's pretty good at it. Right, Luna, can't go on the road now. Come on now, Pep. Come on the next destination. We need to get there shortly. What we go now? Ah, she's happy getting in now, you see. She's had a wee dilly dally now. You need a dilly dally, don't you, Pep? I'll just strap you in again. Yeah, cause we fly in the car. She leave the windows open. How long have I left them windows open? There's three or four flies in here already. We're only here about 15 minutes. Four flies. 